the first thing that you do when you're stressed and there's too much to do? Well, you jump right into that to-do list and start getting things done, crossing things off the list, right? Turns out that may be putting you at a disadvantage. We often tackle our busy lives by doing more. We think if we can just do more, then we'll be less stressed out and we'll, we'll have gotten it all done. But that doesn't often work because busyness in our lives is like a game of whack-a-mole. The faster you whack down those moles, the game is actually set to make them pop back up faster. So you never really make that much headway in your to-do list. And you get so stressed out while you're doing it that it's terrible for you. The key to managing stress is not in doing more. In fact, it's not in doing at all. It's in thinking more. Because what happens when we get stressed out is our brain starts to work against us. We have two settings in our brain that are called the locus of control. We can either behave like we have an internal locus of control or an external locus of control. When we have an internal locus of control, we recognize that we are making the decisions. We have power. And when we have an external locus of control, we're acting like we just got to do this and that and the other thing and whatever anybody says, and we're being jerked in a ton of different directions, and we're at fate's mercy. That's an external locus of control. Well, when we get into that external locus of control mode, we are panicking. We're not doing our best work. We are not behaving very powerfully. And that makes us feel terrible and feel stressed. So before you tackle your to-do list, you actually first have to shift your mindset. If you switch to an internal locus of control, then you'll actually be able to do all of the things on your to-do list, but you'll be doing them in a healthy way. By switching to an internal locus of control, doesn't matter how long your to-do list is, it doesn't get any shorter just by switching your mindset. But when you have an internal locus of control, you recognize that you are in control. Your to-do list isn't in control. Your kid's to-do list is, isn't in control. Your spouses, your friends, everything that everybody wants from you, that's not what has control. You have control. You set your priorities. You choose. So. In order to tackle your to-do list, don't start with your to-do list. First, start with your mindset. Make sure you have an internal locus of control. And then, no matter how long your to-do list is, you can get through your day, you can get through your week without becoming as stressed out as you were before. Wishing you a short to-do list and a little bit of peace this week. Good luck with that internal locus of control.